Hey guys, so Lauren Frank here, and we have our Time Shot Focus Banner. So, yeah, we're gonna go for that. There's also two more banners, so I'll just kind of go for them, and then we'll go right into sort of Time Shot stuff. Out of these units, only Silk is the only one that's not. Uh, well, sorry, Silk's the only one who's gonna be in that normal banner for a little while, so we'll kind of briefly go over it as usual. We'll kind of go for another. Alm is very aggressive in a way. It's fucking on refinement gives him uh, additionals, uh, an additional attack at the cost of 5 HP when his HP is at max. He also gets refined 2 instead of refined 3. So, yeah, no, refined. The first level of refined instead of refined the second one. I think that's. Yeah, you know what I mean. Uh, Draconic Aura, then attack plus 3, you can probably turn that in. Wind Sweep, which is good. Unfortunately, with uh, no disrupt and stuff being a thing, I think it's going to be a... Celica! I do not have her, still don't. Uh, the two years she's been out. Three years, sorry. No, technically... Yeah, it's still two, two years at the moment. Was it three? I don't know anymore. Okay, we'll be coming close to where you can get. So, Ragnarok is not too bad. Bad, blazing light, this is defense, and spur defense. Three. Overall, okay. Silk is your new level healer. There, she puts guard on foes. Oh, she actually. Oh, no, she has a. Uh, Halloween Mia's weapon. As uh, just one that can be defaulted. That's it, right. Because she resets magic cooldown and puts guard 2 on. So that's not bad. We'll put guard, yeah. Then recover, or frat bomb, down his staff. Staff's are in straight. There's quite a lot here. So do what you guys. Best luck on your refuse summon. Well, I can already tell what my color is for. Let's go with this color. It gave me a leaf before. I'm supposed to talk with the hero rises afterwards. Okay, there is potential, but I don't get anything good. As I said, we won't get anything good because I really don't think anyone likes Sir Sarah. I personally don't, and that's because I play at Fire. The actual game she's in. Anyway, these focus banners are just focus banners. Uh, take your pick, whatever. I'm going to. The only uh, focus five star is. The only five star that's going to be there normally is going to be Morfana. So I'm going to try for Morfana. And watch me get a free star. I was kidding, but sure. Why not? Uh, we'll do this last banner here. Uh, free pick, whatever. Takes your boat. I'm gonna go with this blue. Nidian's the only five star here, so I will like a Nidian. Obviously, for her home dragon ability. What was a water home? Oh, Hanoka! Okay. Guess I have a dupe of her now. Fair enough. Uh, HP dying speed up. I need to double check to see which one's better between the one I have and her and the one I just pulled. I, I, no, I'll do it on my own time. So let's kind of go. So actually, yeah, here. Actually, we can check here where Rice is now. I think it'll show us the results currently. No, it is not, unfortunately. That is quite the shame. So I'll actually have to load the information. Nah. We'll do that. I'll get that all set up. So Tempest Shell, or Bat, or. Actually, yeah, it's not the battle speed one, even attack wave one, close card one. I think even attack wave is going to be the first one, or the foul speed, either one or the other. Then the other is going to take a second slot, and close guard is going to be your last one. Ah, oh, crap. So, aside from that, though, your time travel focus units, we kind of covered that. Uh, is there anything else? Does it tell you something? I'm gonna see if I can get the information here, or at least the one that we have seen, because that's when, although I actually am just looking at all up on Twitter. Uh, unfortunately, last thing I had was uh, going for Dragaya Lost, but, ah, here we go. So I'll give you guys kind of a thoughts on this one. So first place, Altina. I mean, I'm not gonna argue that's a great unit. Uh, Sophis, also a good unit. It's not bad with two mythic heroes. Legendary Sir is on third. One of the best dancer units in the game. Winter Sophist. Okay, yeah, I can see that being a thing. Leaf? I mean, he's about to leave, so. 
you know, it'd be nice to kind of pick him up at least at some point. Then we have Elgar the Sixth. She's she's in the regular Bonner. I I don't think we need to get an extra a free Eldegard. Just just one for the out there. I've got Eldegard. People have got Eldegard, and she's going to be here for at least two years. You're fine. Then we have legendary Alm. Um, okay, yeah, I can definitely see that being being a group pick. Uh, legendary Leaf is the last one. These are currently the eight that are in the voting conflict. Definitely good. Your choices minus the other guard, and also while I was looking through this, the other heroes I would look and have notable questions well, things of is well, actually probably be best as the only unit, the units that are in the eleventh, that are in the ninth and twentieth spot that I would definitely like to see come up. Come up. So we have the Alscarian Duo Alphons, the year unit, perfectly good choice. Fair enough. And Ephraim Duo. Again, that is a good pick. And that is all because everything else. Oh, Legendary Roy Star as well. Yeah, that's good. Legendary Ike was there. He's 14th. Why? You got a free Legendary Ike already. And I'm way going on this. But I'll wrap this up here. Best of luck on your footing and stuff. Best of luck on your free banners. And I will see you all next time. Unfortunately, I might have to get the summons as quick on these new banners as quick as possible because. I probably won't have access to stuff, my recording stuff for a while, for a good bit tomorrow with the bonus right. But I'll see you next time, regardless.